Shift4Shop has an integrated rewards program that allows your customers to earn points for every dollar that they spend. They can then use those rewards points to purchase select products in your store. So let's get started. The first thing we need to do is turn on the rewards module. Go to modules and rewards points for customers. If we go into the settings, we're going to enable rewards and we want to take a look at the rewards multiplier. The default option is one, so one point for every dollar that's spent. But you can make this two, you can make this 0 0.5. There's also custom event points that you can set up. For example, for new registrations, for newsletter signups, for sending out referral links, or even a review post. If you want your rewards points to expire, you can then click this option, and you have two other options. You can determine how many days it expires, so let's say one year. You can also have an email sent out before the expiration by default. No products in your store can be used with rewards points, so you actually need to go in and select specific products that can be redeemed with reward points. It's important to note that reward points cannot be used on products with different options. If your store involves a lot of products with different options that you want to include, sometimes it's just easier to set up a single gift certificate that can be purchased with rewards points. To activate a specific product for rewards, go into your products and your product lists, then go into the product you want to include. As you can see below, in the reward options you have two options. One is to provide specific custom points for that purchase, and two is how many points it takes to redeem the product. So let's say we're going to offer one point per dollar spent, and we want to say it takes 100 points to redeem. Then you save. In some cases, you may not want to provide reward points for any of these purchases, and in that case, if you click Disable Rewards, customers will not accrue reward points from these purchases. It's also possible for you to manually add rewards points for a customer. This could be for a variety of reasons, the most likely being someone's purchased something physically in your store and you're adding it manually. So in that case, we go into our customer list, click into the customer, and if we go into the rewards tab, we can then add the new rewards. Here we'll add 50 points and click save. And as you can see, we now have 50 points included. If you want to keep specific customer groups from receiving rewards points, you can do that as well. For example, maybe we don't want our wholesale customers to receive reward points. So if we go into Customers, Manage Groups, and if we come into Wholesale, we could disable reward points. You can also use reward and bonus points within our promotions. So let's say we want to set up a specific promotion. We'll come over to Promotion Manager, and we're creating 100 bonus points for $250 spent, and we're going to make it an automatic promotion, and we'll save. So let's go into the promotion offer, which will be 100 points. In the promotion rules, add in the minimum order amount of $250, and save that and enable it. And now we have an automatic promotion that will give them 100 bonus points if they spend $250. If a customer ever wants to redeem their bonus points, they just need to log into their account. They'll scroll down to see the amount of points they have, and if they click the Redeem button, they'll see any products that are available for redemption. But because this account only has 50 points, they're not able to redeem at this time. The newsletter system also has a smart list that allows you to email customers with active reward points available. So again, if we come into Marketing, go into Newsletters, and Smart Lists, you'll see all customers with active reward points. If we come into Advanced, we can change the variable right here to be the minimum reward points available. So maybe in this case, only those that have 100 or more. Finally, the reward system also provides a widget to notify customers about anything in your rewards program. If we go into Modules, Rewards, Settings, we can restore our widget code. You can then copy and place this anywhere on your content, such as header and footer, or title and content. And that's how easy it is to create a reward system within your Shift4Shop store.